Yeah, we had Charlie Chaplin's original working manuscript of what he always said was his favorite film, Monsieur Verdoux. It was his thing. And there were two shots, drawings on virtually every page, comments, changes of dialogue. It was his working manuscript. And um, we, we sold it. We, <laughs> we, <laughs> we, we actually got the, um, the DVD to see the film. What, what, what was the name of it? Monsieur Verdoux. Monsieur. Chaplin always said it was his favorite of all of his films. And Louis and I watched it at Louis' apartment. And to both of us thought, this is the worst piece of rubbish imaginable. This is dreadful. It was dreadful. We thought it was dreadful. It was Chaplin's favorite film. And that, we finished it. Louis took it. And he threw it in the trash. He threw the DVD away. And, yeah. But we sold that. And the, a very famous um, director, Italian director, Giuseppe Torratore, you know, he, he wrote and directed Cinema Paradiso. Mm. He loves Chaplin. Mm. And um, a mutual a friend of ours, brought him in. He flew in for other reasons, of course, to LAX. And our friend picked him up at LAX, told him about the chap that he wanted to come right here. The luggage was in the car. He came right here. And he sat in the chair in the front room. Really, he kept going, oh, it's a fantastic. This is magnificent. Oh, my God, it's a Chaplin. You know, I don't believe I'm all in chap. Look what he writes. This is Chaplin. This is fantastic. How much? How much it is? So he told him it was expensive. He said, oh, I I don't have, this is too much for me, this is too much money for me. Oh, it's worth it, we had the money. So I said, well, we'll, we'll take off 25% if it goes to you. Oh, so it's like, I, oh, yeah. I was practically on the verge of tears. You know, he just couldn't afford it, and we couldn't let it go for less than, than that kind of a discount. And ultimately, we put it up for auction and in London, and it, and it sold. Yeah.